Good morning. Uh, I have something I want to show you guys this morning. Uh, check this out for just a minute. So what was I doing? Yeah, I was washing someone's foot, wasn't I? Happened to be my wife Jeanette's foot, and, and that wasn't a big deal. Her foot wasn't too bad to wash because it was already pretty clean. But it did stink just a little. I'm teasing, it didn't stink. Sorry, Jeanette. Did you know that, the, that Jesus one time washed all 12 of his disciples' feet? Can you imagine doing that? I mean, these guys walked on dirt all day long. They wore nothing but a pair of sandals and it just had a couple little straps across the top. So their feet were really dirty when Jesus washed them. But Jesus took a towel and he took a water basin or a water bowl and he bent down and he washed each of their feet. Can you imagine doing that? I wonder why he did that. Well, Jesus actually told them in John chapter 13 why he did it. He told them that he washed their feet as an example for them, that, that they were to serve each other. He was showing them what we call humility, which means he was teaching them to think more about others than about themselves. He was teaching them to always serve other people. Jesus wants us to have humility and to serve others. Now that doesn't mean we have to wash each other's feet, but we should be willing to do something like that. And you know, some churches actually have foot washing worship services where they wash each other's feet. How would you guys like to do that? I've done it a couple times and I, I can tell you it's a little strange because we're not used to it, uh, but it's a good thing. But here's the point. We're called to serve each other. We can humbly serve each other in all kinds of other ways. We can do something as simple as opening a door for someone. We can take food to someone. Maybe you guys bake cookies and could take them to a neighbor. Right now, we can wear our mask uh, just to help other people be extra safe. We don't want to spread anything to each other. We can say really nice things about other people instead of you know, bragging about ourselves. We could go to a neighbor's house and help them pull weeds from their flowers or their garden. Uh, maybe this fall, we could go and rake someone's leaves. The point is there's so many things we can do for each other. So let's be humble and let's serve each other. Let's pray now and ask God to remind us and sh just show us ways that we can serve. Let's pray together. Lord, Make us humble. Show us the people around us that are in need. Keep us from only thinking about ourselves. Help us serve other people. Open our eyes to see what other people need. And then when we see it, help us serve them. Help us do something, Lord, that would truly help someone and serve them. This week, bring to mind someone we can serve and then send us out to serve them. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, thanks for joining me, you guys. I hope you have a great week. Bye and find someone to serve this week. See you.